Studio Kim with the hype 411. Young act Daniel Bryker Rose is the latest artiste signed to the 18 year old producer Marcus Marys Marcus Records. Bryker is Banton's nephew, but he says that being the relative of a famous artiste doesn't guarantee that his career will be smooth sailing. Instead, he says that being an official part of the Marcus Records team should definitely help. So far, the young act has recorded a few singles, with his focus being the social issues that he believes need to be highlighted, but sending the message in somewhat of a different way. Bryker joins DJ D East as the artist signed to the Marcus Records, which will release and has been releasing a number of singles this year already and has plans for even more. Sisla Kalanji is strongly defending fellow female singer Queen Africa, who has been under some serious pressure from gay rights groups in Jamaica and Canada. Recently, a Canadian group lobbied that she be cut from a lineup of performers at an event in Canada after she performed this past August and mentioned her lack of support for the homosexual lifestyle in JA. When speaking with the media recently, Sisla Kalanji said that the gay community should really stop targeting Queen Africa. He explained that there's no reason why the people of Jamaica should not speak out against it. He added too that yes, there's a time and place for everything and that maybe there was some fault on Africa's part. But at the same time, he says no matter where or when it's said, he gives absolutely no support for that lifestyle. The president of the LAMA College for Music Professionals in California, Tom Addisbury, recently announced a scholarship in the name of Grammy-winning reggae star Ziggy Marley. The Ziggy Marley Artiste Scholarship is to be awarded annually to the most deserving applicant for LAMA's music degree programs. The announcement was made at an invite-only event at the school recently where Marley got to speak of his views on the history of the music industry and where he believes it's headed now. Addisbury says that he is glad that the students got to hear from Marley and that it's a great honor to have a scholarship being offered in his name. Marley is appreciative of the gesture and gave words of encouragement to the students, alumni, and the special guests who were present at the event. Okay, Hype Peeps, I'm Yorkim, and that's the Hype for 1-1.